A very welcome to a new Shrine Guide video here on the Proximus Gaming YouTube channel. My name is Michael and in this video the Shai Uto Shrine, also known as Halt the Tilt. The Shai Uto Shrine is located in Farron Woods, behind the lakeside stable in a cave protected by a bombable rock wall at the base of Ubuta Point. It is easiest to start at the Farron Tower. Just head southeast, jump off and glide down. By the way, if you like this video then please give this video a thumbs up. That helps with the discoverability a lot. What also helps is to subscribe to the channel if you have not done that yet. Then you won't miss my future content and, well, we need more subscribers. So come on, let's do that. When you land, you can find some nice bananas here, some mighty bananas, which are always useful. Just keep continuing to the southeast and there's the lakeside stable. Behind that, you can indeed find a bombable rock. Use your bomb room and blow it up. And there you find it, the Shai Uto Shrine. Time to get in. To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Shai Ito. In the name of Goddess Haile, I offer this trial. Halt the tilt, Shai Ito Shrine. We need our stasis rune for this shrine, so use your stasis rune on the first rep and walk up. Since your stasis rune needs to recharge, we just have to wait a little bit before we can continue. Use your stasis room on the next ramp and walk on. Here we can find the first treasure chest. Open it and a nice traveler's sword is inside. We're gonna need this treasure chest later up in this shrine. So when we wait until our stasis room is fully recharged, get yourself your magnesis room, pick up the chest and put it on the other side of the platform. Now go stand on the ramp so it moves, use your stasis rune and use it. Now you can walk up on the other side. Get your magnesis rune again and pick up the chest. Walk towards this ramp here. Go stand on the exact edge and make sure that the chest is positioned on the other side on the exact edge. Move it as high as possible with your magnesis room and then just drop it. You will get launched, use your paraglider in order to get to the next chest. Open it and an ancient core is inside. What I did here is using the magnesis rune again in order to lock the next ramp with the treasure chest. You can also just stasis the other ramp, it's up to you. In my case I stasis this one. Go towards the monk and press A. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of Goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. Do 
spirit orb, a symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the challenges of a shrine. May the goddess smile upon you. And we did it! Next shrine completed! Next time, another shrine guide on the Proximus Gaming YouTube channel. This was Michael signing off. See ya!